I feel like I have taken losses throughout my whole uh, adult life publicly. Um, to be accused of steroids, um, people, you go from hero to zero immediately in some people's eyes. And even though USADA has proven uh, that, that there's a reason for those picograms, the picograms give you zero athletic performance. You don't ever, you never look like a guy who's on steroids. And even though I'm, I'm viewed as a steroid user uh, in some people's eyes for the rest of my life, which, which hurts me deeply, honestly. Um, that's a defeat. You know, I lost my mom. You know, that's a defeat. I lost my sister to cancer. Uh, that's a defeat. Um, I, hit, I hit and run against a pregnant woman. Um, humiliating. And, and, and just, you looked at as a monster. You know, to be able to involved in something like that, that's a defeat. Come to this, to this terms that all of us humans, we do jump. Excuse me. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Some I can second that. <laughs> some of us get caught, you know, some of us don't. You know, we all have skeletons in our closet. And, um, and um, at the end of the day, it's important for us to, especially guys in our position, to uh, to be an example of, of getting back on your horse, getting back on your feet, thinking of yourself in the most high regards and, and, and trying to live up to the person that we want to be, you know? And, um, and that's where I'm at today. No, I, I just know what it takes to, uh, to be in this position. You know, it takes a lot of hard work. It takes, it takes a lot of humility. Um, you know, arrogance caused you to not train as hard. It caused you to uh, rely on talent and things like that. Um, I've won every fight that I've ever been in because I have enough humility to get my ass in the gym every single day and, uh, and to do the extra, to do the mountain biking, to do the swimming. Either you have it or you don't. And uh, I know that I'm a dog at the end of the day. I have, that, I have a dog in me, I have a lion in me, I have, I have a, uh, a vicious, warrior inside of me it's who i am and uh losing is not an option this is not just a sporting event to me this is this is my life this is my image this is my legacy um, this is me and um my reasons why are really big you know my reasons why are really big and i, I don't know if his energy matches mine when it comes to the seriousness of how i take this this fight in this game He's had one or two big fights on Fight France, it's a big fight. But do you think there's a chance that as he's walking to that cage on Saturday, the moment just starts to build and build and get to him, whereas it just won't be it? You know, I, I could see him staying composed uh, in the moment. Uh, he fought Taito Tsubasa in front of his home country. I'm, I'm sure that was a massive moment for him. Um, but I'm not Taito Tsubasa. I look nothing like him. I, I don't perform like him. I'm not Derek Lewis, I'm not Francis Ngannou. I'm a much, much different athlete. I'm by far the most versatile athlete he's ever faced, the most experienced athlete he's ever faced. And whether he realizes it in the cage, uh, or walking to the cage or not, he will realize it by maybe by round two or round one. He'll, he'll realize it, he'll realize it.